And do you live alone, Therese Balavet? I do. Well, there's Richard. He'd like to live with me. Oh, no, it's nothing like that. I mean, he'd like to marry me. I see. And would you like to marry him? Well, I barely even know what to order for lunch. down cakes from the magazine. It ain't working out too good. Come on, let's get you Coca-Cola. Telling them to attack the homeland. If it wasn't for him, Al-Qaeda would still be focused on overseas targets. If you really want to protect the homeland, you need to get Bin Laden. This guy never met Bin Laden. This guy's a freelancer working off the fucking internet. No one's even talked to Bin Laden in four years. He's out of the game. He may well even Dead. He might as well be fucking dead. But you know what you're doing? You're chasing the ghost while the whole fucking network goes all around you. You just want me to nail some low-level mullah crack adult so you can check that box in your resume that says while you were in Pakistan, you got a real terrorist. But the truth is, you don't understand Pakistan, and you don't know Al-Qaeda. Either give me the team I need to follow this lead, or the other thing we're gonna have on your resume is being the first station chief to be called before a congressional committee for subverting the efforts to capture or kill Bin Laden. Come on now, we're all right. We're all right. People pass along. Nothing stays the same. You still got the other two. The Lord gives and the Lord takes away. That's the way he is. I love you, Sharon. I do. I love you, baby. I mean, you ain't got to love me. Lord knows I did not have love for you when you needed it. I know that. You ain't gotta love me. But you gonna know that I love you. You hear? You hear me, Sharon? I hate you, Mama. My mother was an only child. 
and so was my father. And uh, I was their only child. So uh, when I'm gone, I'm the end of the line. My family will be finished. What do you say? You let me adopt you. I, I could be, uh, say, your grandfather. Could we talk about this? get back from Alaska. Would that be okay? for me to admit that I've been standing in the same place for 18 years. Well, I've been standing with you. I've been right here with you, Troy. I've had a life, too. I gave 18 years of my life to stand in the same spot as you. Don't you think I ever wanted other things? Don't you think I had dreams and hopes? What about my life? What about me? Don't you think I ever crossed my mind to want to know other men that I wanted to lay up somewhere and forget about my responsibilities and I wanted someone to make me laugh so I could feel good. You're not the only one who's got wants and needs, but I held on to your joy. I took all my feelings, my wants, needs, and dreams, and I buried them inside you. I planted a seed to watch a prayed over. I planted myself inside you and waited to pull. It didn't take me no 18 years to realize the soil was hard and rocky and it was never gonna blow. Remember, if you'd had a weak handshake, you don't get to that position with a, with a weak handshake. No, so we had a firm handshake. What else? It was smart. Oh, I always kept him smart. <laughs> and did you remember anything he said? Hello. 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 Might have been hi. Hello. He was polite. <gasps> well, no, well, he was smart and he had a firm handshake. He said hello. And he said hello. Nice. Hello. He was polite. <laughs> oh, Martin. Fuck! 
Fuck you, April! Fuck you and all your hateful... What are you gonna do now? Are you gonna hit me? Show me how much you love me? Don't worry, I can't be bothered. You're not worth the trouble it would take to hit you. You're not worth the powder it would take to blow you up. You are an empty, empty, hollow shell of a woman. I mean, what the hell are you doing in my house if you hate me so much? Star. I could have killed you, huh? I need more of that cocktail shit you got. You got enough for 20 of us? Yeah. You know what? You don't deserve our money. You homophobic ass, huh? How did she die? Um, she got very sick. My mother's a singer. She's taught me many songs. Oh, really? Would you like to hear one? Me? From this valley they say you are leaving. We shall miss your bright eyes and sweet smile. For you take with you all of the sunshine that is bright in our pathway a while. Then come sit by my side if you love me. Not hasten to bid me adieu. Just remember the Red River Valley and the cowboy that loved you so true. Just remember the Red River Valley and the cowboy that loved you so true. That was really beautiful. I did not have sexual relations with that woman. 